Well, bad news. I'm kind of kicking myself here. I thought the next thing I would do is work on the steering because uh, this International Harvester 300U has power steering and without the hydraulics doesn't do you any good. So I thought I'd work on getting this hooked up and all this monkeying around and everything um, accidentally ended up breaking one of the brush holders. Not this one, but one on the back where you can't see it. Um, part of the problem with this project is everything is just so big and heavy. I need an engine hoist to do anything. Like this motor, I can't even lift it. It's just too darn big. Um, maybe the uh, silver lining of this is that I do have a different hydraulic pump motor. This is a much smaller one. And where's my banana? I need... Oh. Uh. So that's our... Uh, big pump motor and then this is the smaller one um, the other thing is that this runs on just 12 volts whereas that's out of a 36 volt uh, forklift so this one's not going to be as powerful um, but running on 12 volts will make it real simple at least for now of course it uses different size fittings and different styles of fittings so I had to go and buy you know 50 bucks worth of adapters at the tractor store and an extra hose, but I should be able to uh, get that hooked back up here. And the other thing is there's a little bit better mounting bracket on here. So I should be able to get this motor uh, hooked up right here. And after all that's done, I should have power steering. Uh, the other fun thing I did was, um, this is where the gas cap filler was. Uh, and I 3D printed a part so now I have a place to set a drink so uh, I can have a beverage while working on my project.